Hey folks, project update. And this is the project update. Had a subscriber a while back that was curious about this and wanted me to see if I could do a review and about it and stuff and kind of get it going and using it. And they thought it was a model 4700. Let me get over here and see. This is an old one. This is just a 47 International Square Baler. Model 47. And for those of you just tuning in, this thing had set 20 years at least, maybe a little more than that, and it has been rained in out in the pretty well the open. There wasn't much cover over it. And everything is stuck solid. The chains, the gears, the flywheel over here, and I have tried pretty hard to get everything unstuck, but everything is stuck, so I can't get it unstuck. And it's not worth putting a lot of time and a lot of man hours in this. And I got this in a big farm buyout. So that was where the case went, was in it and all that. But like I said, this thing is in pretty bad shape. But I was going to try it in all fairness. But as you can see, I mean it's just ate out all over. And everything is just rusted solid. The chains won't move. Nothing will move. And... I mean, it's bad. I was hoping it'd come unstuck, but I've tried and I'm not going to put a lot of time and a lot of money in this because this just ain't worth it. And what I'm going to do, because like I said, this thing is, it just ain't worth it. It's in bad shape. I'm going to take the shaft off, the tongue off. You know, some of the miscellaneous parts I'm going to cut off and everything. Save these implement wheels that's on it. And there's a few other parts on it. And then she's going to go across the scale. Because it is super rough and it's just not worth putting time and money in. But I'll save the shafts and the tongue and stuff like that for other projects. I'm going to, you know, get the parts I can get out of it. And then what's left, there ain't going to be much left when I get done with it. But... It's going to go across the scales after I get all the parts off of it. So, I wanted to do an update for the subscriber that was interested in this. So, sorry guys, it, it's no good. And I did try. I tried to get it unstuck, but I'm not going to put a bunch of money and a bunch of time in something that's just flat up not worth it. So, I figured I would post that and let, you know, in case they've been really waiting and wanting to know what it turned out to be. It's a bust. So, unfortunately, we're going to get the parts we can get off of it and scrap it and send her across scales and wire her out. I'm going to get the parts I can get and say bye-bye. So, anybody knows my channel, been following, there ain't going to be much left when I get done. We're just going to scrap it. So, like I said, I'm going to get what parts I can get out of this and salvage what I can and then the rest is gonna go across scales because it's just not worth it folks not worth time or the money so we'll get tongue and parts off and i'll get what i can use out of it and then get rid of it make room for another project so and while we're on the subject do stay tuned because here in the next few days and anybody been following me knows what this stuff is parts and stuff on that buyout but here in a few days i'm gonna drag this out and try it this little five foot pull behind brush hog. We're going to put it behind the C over there and do a little clean up. I'm pretty sure this will work, but I might get fooled. So stay tuned for that because that's going to come up here in the next few days. And we'll get it going and check the grease and all that stuff on it and then hook it up and see what she does. So, as I guess. So, as always, like and subscribe and we'll catch you on the next video. Bye.